Just because you are a celebrity does not mean that you're knowledgeable. This channel is about What is going on folks and folk at Ramaz? I am Ty Smith, Modern Renaissance Man. Welcome to my channel, Modern Renaissance Man. If you are someone that's been following my channel for a while, double check to make sure that you are subscribed. Don't forget, if you like this video, I'm going to remind you again in the end anyway to give the video a thumbs up so it can be circulated within the YouTube realm. All right, appreciate it. And also, if you want to check how you can support the channel, check the links in the description down below, okay? If you do, great. If you don't, great. Oh, boy, boy, boy. Y'all, do I need to go to like a screen? Y'all want me to do like a little pausing and all that stuff? We're going to watch the video in its entirety. But then we're going to come back and analyze it, okay? That's what we'll do. All right, all right, give me a second. And just like that, we are back, ladies and gentlemen. So this is Leslie Jones, and apparently she said some things that seem to be a little off or outrageous, and people were saying that it could be virtue signaling, yada, yada, peanut butter. But we're going to find out what it's all about here in a second. Yeah, I try to get my chair out of the way, but it's in front of my piano. Um, So we're going to do this all together, all right? So here we go. What's up, y'all? I was going to write a post out. Hold on, wait a minute. Give me a second. I need to do something here real quick, folks. I need to make sure this is coming out of my sound, right? And and like we were doing before, let's try this again. Here we go. What's up, y'all? I was going to write a post out, but um, I just feel like I need to say this. You know, I would say happy 4th of July, but it's not really a happy 4th of July, is it? Because 4th of July is supposed to stand for independence and, you know, how a country fought for freedom, all this stuff. But this ain't the land of the free. Y'all have taken away women's rights. You're trying to take away voters' rights. You're, you're, you're not representing anything that this holiday is supposed to be about. You know? Um, I, I, I listen to the Star Spangled Banner and all of that, and I go, this is not the land of the free. This is not nothing that we're saying that it is. Nothing. Nothing. So it's hard for me to say Happy Fourth of July because it feels like, we going back to slavery, you know, so maybe I should say happy back to slavery day. What the hell did you just say? Because if we don't do something, there will be no Independence Day for anyone. What the hell? Dude, what in the world was that? What? Hold on. Wait a minute. Why? Hold on. What happened here? Why did my stuff disappear like that? Hold the front door. Let me go back to that, man. Get back over here, Leslie Jones, ladies and gentlemen. What the actual... Ooh, wee, that's scary. Hold on. Get back to this. Hold on. Hold on. Let's go ahead and analyze this real quick. Here we go. <clears throat> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But... Why? Why, Leslie? Why? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. this is not the land of the free then what is it then bam okay bam how 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 are they trying to take away voters rights now if you are saying that about where we are right now folks that's why i made the comment in the beginning when i said what i said about celebrities if you saying that right now, why is it that black people own land? Why is it black people own their own businesses? Why is it that black people have jobs and own homes and all that, et cetera, et cetera? Why is it that you women are voting right now? Why? Why? Because you do know if you're talking about going back during that time, I listened to the Star Spangled Banner and she's saying going back during those times. If America was not what you said it is, then why are you allowed to do the things you're doing right now? Why are black people allowed to vote right now? Huh? Why are women allowed to vote right now? In fact, if you want to go back in time, you weren't allowed to do any of that unless you own some land. If you own property, what are you talking about now? You don't have to own anything to vote. So when you're talking about voter rights and all that, what are you talking about? Oh, because, oh, oh, because they want you to show an ID to show, to show proof that you are a U.S. citizen or something like that. Come on now. Stop, Leslie. Stop. Again, what this holiday is supposed to be about originally? You want to go back to that times, you would not be talking right now <laughs> saying this. You won't even be voting. You wouldn't even be a comedian making all the millions of dollars that you're making right now, Leslie. What are you talking about? 
See, that's what I'm saying, folks. A lot of people get things mixed up here. And what I'm saying this for is I've been there. I've done it before. What are you talking about, Ty? A lot of times we think that because a person is of a certain stature of fame, we assume that they are very knowledgeable and stuff. Am I the only one that ever done that? I know. I know I'm the only one that ever done that. No, we put people up on pedestals in our mind. So a lot of times, like what she's saying right now, I guarantee it's going to be a lot of people that voted. Not voted. <laughs> There's going to be a lot of people that follow her and agree with her. Yeah, see, that's right. It's supposed to be about this. It's supposed. Uh, <laughs> you go back to when the Independence, uh, whenever the Star Spangled Banner was written and when the Independence Day happened, we weren't doing none of the stuff we're doing right now. So what are you talking about? Oh, God, let me go ahead. I, I, I listened to the Star Spangled Banner no, you didn't. and all of that, and I go, this is not the land of the free. This is not nothing that we're saying that it is. Nothing. Nothing. So it's hard for me to say happy 4th of July because it feels like we're going back to slavery, you know? So maybe I should say happy back to slavery day because... How, guys? How in the world do you correlate whatever she's talking about right now with happy slave day because guess what number one in the constitution there is nothing written about no women's rights when it comes to abortion in fact if y'all want to go deep on there we hold these true self evidence that all men are created equal and you know let me skip a little few things and can actually pursue life liberty and the pursuit of happiness uh if a child is in your stomach what life are they able to have what liberty are they able to have and what pursuit of happiness because i'm pretty sure a baby does not want to be killed what are you talking about? So anyway, you saying you listen to the Star Spangled Banner and everything in there is okay. No, 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 no. Because again, you are free right now, number one. Number two, you actually are a comedian doing good things, I guess. You want to say to me, you're not all that funny. And only in certain instances, whatever. You know, a little over the top to me, overrated. You are a millionaire, Leslie. So what are you talking about? Not free? Going back to slavery? women's rights what in the world does this have to do with women's rights y'all y'all keep on throwing it around i know a lot of women gonna get upset with this what do you mean women's rights what rights are you talking about the same rights i have are the same rights you women have oh except i can't go kill a child though y'all can in the name of saying abortion y'all can do that what do you mean you can't do what you want to to your body like what y'all getting breast implants y'all getting booty implants liposuction men getting chest implants too yes they do men getting calf implants bicep implants your body, your choice, huh? Oh, except if it comes to C19. But anyway, I digress from that. So what I'm saying right now is what is it that you women, I'm serious, and I don't, don't think I'm coming off of being condescending. I'm just asking, what rights have they taken away from you women? I want to know what rights. Can y'all vote? Yes. Can y'all go and eat what y'all want to when y'all want to? Yes. Can y'all work out? Yes. Can y'all get high paying jobs? Yes. Can y'all become CEOs? Yes. Can y'all, what is it? What is? What are you talking about? What is it that somebody is making you and forcing you to do to your body? Huh? Oh, you're talking about what it's forcing you to do to somebody else's body. Oh, I get it. Again, life, liberty, the pursuit of happiness. Tell me this. Answer me this. Can an unborn child have those things? Can an unborn, can a, can an unborn child say that I am created equal? We hold these true self-evident that all, that all men are created equal. Does a does an unborn child have unalienable rights? Does an unborn child have life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness? Hmm? Does, does an unborn child have all that? So again, don't speak and start saying a bunch of nonsense when you don't even know history and stuff. Because again, if you studied the history, there were no black folks that had what these rights are, what we claiming we crying about right now. They didn't have that at Independence Day. I don't know if a lot of folks know that, but you did not have that at Independence Day. Know your history. So anyway, and what she mean? Happy Slave Day. What in the world does that have to do with us? Happy Slave Day. Be happy that they actually wanted to have Independence Day because they, the four, a lot of the forefathers were abolitionists who wanted to end slavery, who actually right from the beginning was trying to write the king to tell him that this is wrong what they're doing. Be happy that a lot of white people called pilgrims. Yeah, pilgrims. Yeah, pilgrims. When they landed on Plymouth Rock, pilgrims arrested those white people that had men as slaves and women as slaves. They arrested them and freed those black people. So when you talk about Independence Day, be glad that they did something like that. And again, if you are so upset and pissed off about America, quit virtue signaling and leave. Go back to Africa. If it's that, oh, here you go, Bill, like Donald Trump being racist. I'm just saying, if you are so pissed off and mad about what's going on in America right now, 
leave. Nobody's asking you to stay. Oh, but you won't be able to do that, right? Because some of these countries are not going to allow you to run your mouth like you're doing right now. To freely, so expressively speak like you're doing right now. Other countries won't allow you to do that, though, right? Okay. Yeah, you're talking about slavery. There are still slaves today. Are y'all speaking out against that? There are still slaves today in Africa and other countries. There is legitimate, legal slavery going on. So that's what I'm saying, folks. Don't fall for this nonsense right here. There's just another thing of folks doing just a virtue signal to push something out there to get people all stirred up and aroused. You should be insulted that she feel that a lot of black folks are going to fall for this stuff and get y'all all roused up and mad. And some of y'all going to be mad. Some of y'all are full supporters of Leslie. And you're going to come at me because you're mad I'm talking about your girl instead of listening to the words that I'm saying to you. There is nothing that she said that is true. Independence Day. Talking about freedom. What, what black person is not free right now? What type of inclination do you get from this to show that we're going back towards slavery? That will never happen again. Ever happen again. You want to know why? Because there's still people in the United States right now. Devil, you know what? You almost, if they was to even try to do something like that, you would be able to see how united America is. Because it would be a ton of white people like there was before that will sit there and put their lives on the line to make sure that slavery never happens again. Then we're going to be able to see how racist America is, right? Throwing that nonsense out there. Nobody going back to no slavery, Leslie. Stop all that. Anyway, folks, am I going over the top with this? Am I a little too crazy? Is Ty going a little overboard with this? Am I way out there with this? Let me know in the comments below to this video. Don't forget, folks, double uh, check to make sure that you are subscribed to the channel. Make sure you hit the bell notification to where it goes ding. And then when you hit the little ding button, make sure it's set to all notifications so you can get notified when I post a video, folks. Also, Giving this video a thumbs up right now will allow us to get circulated within the YouTube algorithm. If you want voices like mine, conservative voices, yada yada peanut butter, to get out there in the universe to where you can look on that telescope and find it. No, I'm just joking. Make sure you share with somebody. Hit the like button, all right? Let me know, folks. We'll see what y'all got to say on this one. I am Ty Smith, Modern Renaissance Man, hoping and praying that every last one of you have food, shelter, and clothing. And most of all, I hope and pray every last one of you guys are in great health. God bless you all through Jesus. What's going on, everybody? So, hey, check this out. I appreciate you guys watching. I appreciate you taking time out of your day to view these videos. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel, give the video a thumbs up. And also, right here is where you can catch the next video, the latest video that I've done. But, like, right up here, this is stuff that I've done kind of in the past. So, in this area, you might find a video that I've done in the past. It can be funny. It can be something serious. It does not matter. But this is something that you can also do to check out more material that I do in my channel. Because I do a lot in this channel, all right? So again, appreciate everything from you guys. Keep on watching it. Keep on supporting it. And God bless you all.